The Big Ten regular season champs last year made it to the Sweet 16. A lot went into, you know, where we finished last year. It was exciting, it was fun, and emotional. Starting fifth in the Big Ten and then finishing with the share of the title and making the tournament run that we did, I think that just a credit to just how connected we were. I think we had a really great finish. I think we know we could have gone farther and, and that's going to motivate us this year. This team is probably the most competitive I've ever been on. And I think our tightness off the court really shows when we get on the court. We do a lot of stuff off the court together. We have a lot of different personalities, so it's it's really fun to be a part of. The big thing we did it was pretty cool. We, uh, we got to travel to Minneapolis, get all dressed up, all decked out, do a bunch of interviews and stuff, some photo shoots, and just get to see other faces from the Big Ten. With the returning group we have, you know, expectations are definitely really high, which we have that in our mind too. We expect a lot out of each other, a lot out of ourselves. So we're in here every day working, we're gonna continue to work and, and build that connection and chemistry out there. But we're excited. We had a great season last year and we just wanna build off of what we created last year. We have a really good non-conference schedule this year, so we wanna go out there and compete every night. Tennessee for game one is gonna be exciting. Right off the gates is gonna be a test and I think that we're gonna be ready for it. the fans to show up for this big game and show up they have indeed. So Tennessee game was one of my all-time favorite games that I ever played. The crowd, the fans, the energy from all the people, we felt it the whole game. The bench was going crazy and just like being down the first part of the game, we knew like we had to lock in and the third quarter, that was insane. Shoemate again keeps it alive. just get a win to open the season. It is a top five win by a dozen points. The Buckeyes send a warning shot, not just across the Big Ten, but across the country. So going into the Louisville game, we knew it was gonna be a huge game. We were playing a top 10 team. Going into the game, we were ready, prepared, but we just knew it was gonna be a tough one. Being down at the half, it was not easy for us, but we had been there before against a really good team. So we knew what it took to come back and try to win the game. And from then on, it just kind of jumped. I try to do the little stuff. We have scores. So I tried to do everything on the other end of the floor. So I just started rebounding and just trying to play the best defense I could. And then once we got the lead, we knew that we had the game. The Ohio State Buckeyes will stay unbeaten. They'll improve to 7 and 0. Being ranked number three in the country is crazy. It motivates us every day to work even harder. And I think this team got a lot to prove. This is going to be a really special year for us. We got a really good group, and we're excited to see everybody at our games. We have really big goals, and we have a lot of goals for each other. And taking it one day at a time is, is what's going to make us really good. 